Hi, Year 5. Let's do some problem solving. So this sheet here is the commuter, commuter train. So pause the video now if you don't have this sheet and come and see me and I'll give it to you. Otherwise, if you have it, we'll continue. So question one, let's read this together. During peak hour, a daily commuter train has 18 carriages. Each carriage has 47 seats and can hold 65 people. How many people can travel on the train and how many of them can sit? So looking at this question, you should identify that it's going to be multiplication. And don't forget that there's two questions, so I'm going to expect two answers for this question. Firstly, how many people can travel on the train? And secondly, how many of them can sit? So try and work out this question, then we'll go on to number two. Number two, let's read this together. There were 1,104 people on the train at the first station, 208 people got on and 394 got off. At the next station, 243 people got on. And then 172 people got off. How many people are on the train now? So I've helped you quite a bit with that question. Um, it looks like there's a lot of pluses and, minus, uh, pluses and minuses that you'll have to do for that question. Pause it now and try to work it out. And we'll go on to question three. So question three, let's look at this one. Let's read it together. At the end of the line, there were 41 people in the first carriage. 41 people in the first carriage. 52 in the second carriage. And 39 in the third carriage. And 47 people in the fourth carriage. How many people are needed to fill the train to capacity? Well, we know with we know from question one that peak hour capacity is 1,170 people. So you might have to do a bit of addition, um, addition there with some numbers and also maybe subtraction. So that's all I'm going to help you with for now. Try and work out the next, uh, the next questions by yourself and then come and see me to check your answers.